Hey everybody, um, it's another, another lovely rainy day and um, I wanted to read this poem for you. Um, it's one of my older ones, it's called Aspic. Um, I'm hoping to go and do some songs, but the biggest problem that I'm having right now is that I don't have a tripod. Um, my tripod snapped during catastrophes of making earlier videos, so I'm waiting for one on order. And um, totally fairly, those things are not a high priority right now. So I'm glad that they're prioritizing the things that are. But for me, that means no tripod, and it means that I'm doing a lot of these in the dark videos because I don't really have the ability to go record at the park again. Not unless I rig my phone to weird places with bunchy cords and tape, and I try not to do that to my poor phone. Anyway, this is Aspic. The problem with falling in love is that no one has to fall with you. And you aren't sure before you jump if they're going to meet you. Sometimes you dive laughing, mad and free. A hand closes on yours midair. The sky and the ground and the cliff fade away. You fall forever and keep falling until you stop. Love dilates the world, suspends you in flies like amber, adoring someone in the space between tick and talk. But when you fall alone, it's all too fast. The ground comes rushing up before you crash. You can feel it the terrible loss that they are never, ever going to take your hand. The ball is another kind of eternity. You aren't suspended, held in the aspect of love, and it doesn't matter because pain also dilates the world. Just remember, when you land, the cliff, it's all just imagery. You aren't really dead. Get up, and if you can't walk away from seeing them in amber flying over your head, then at least resolve to make a good life on the ground. Thank you to my patrons. Please come check me out at www.patreon.com slash Morgan Blake. See you tomorrow.